Using a webcam for your face cam during a gaming session or live stream is a great way to build a strong connection with your audience and make your content better. But more often than not, there's just so much wasted space in your camera's field of view. People want to see your face, not your entire bedroom blocking precious gameplay and eating up precious compression bandwidth. We previously covered methods of background removal for your webcam, but today we're going to cover another trick using a mask to turn your square or rectangular webcam view into a circle that just focuses on your face. It's pretty neat, and you can make it any shape, not just a circle. To get started, go on and set up your normal gameplay scene in OBS, but don't add your webcam just yet. Next, you'll need an image editing program such as Adobe Photoshop. A great free alternative that works perfectly fine for this use case is Paint.net, linked in the video description. I'll walk you through both of these options, so use the time codes in the video description to choose the right program for you. Photoshop. We'll start with Adobe Photoshop. Make a new image. The image resolution needs to be the same as the resolution you're using for your webcam such as 1920 by 1080 or 1280 by 720. For me, it's 1920 wide by 1080 high. You want to make sure that your background is transparent by choosing from the dropdown of background contents and choosing transparent. Hit OK. Next, use one of the shape tools from the toolbar, in our case, the circle or ellipse, and make a circle in the center of your canvas. You want to make it a solid black color filled in and big enough to take up most of the center of the canvas. Make sure it's centered. Now go to the File menu and save this image as a PNG image file and place it with your other stream assets. Paint.net In Paint.net, make a new image. The image resolution needs to be the same as the resolution you're using for your webcam, such as 1920 by 1080 or 1280 by 720. For me, it's 1920 wide by 1080 high. Click OK. Make a new transparent layer and delete the background layer. Next, use one of the shape tools from the toolbar, in our case the circle or ellipse, and make a circle in the center of your canvas. You'll want to make it a solid black color filled in and big enough to take up most of the center of the canvas. Make sure it's centered. Now go to the File menu and save this image as a PNG image file and place it with your other stream assets. Time for OBS Studio. Now that you have your image file, go back to OBS Studio. Add your webcam via video capture device source to your scene. Choose your webcam, adjust your resolution and frame rate if need be, and so on, and hit OK. Right-click the webcam source and hit Filters. Under Effect Filters, click the plus and choose Image Mask Slash Blend, and give it a name, and hit OK. Change the Type from Alpha Mask Color Channel to Alpha Mask Alpha Channel. Then click next to Path, click Browse, and find your image. Hit Close. Shazam! Now your webcam is a circle, or a star, or an arrow, or anything you like all without needing to record your webcam separately and editing the shape in later. This is super handy and can do a lot to make your stream stand out and add a little bit of extra polish to your stream. And as an added bonus, I will have a download for all of these image files that I show you how to make, plus a few extras in case you don't have the ability to make them yourself. I have a download in the description below where you can just download them and use them straight in OBS. I hope this episode of my OBS tutorial course was helpful for you. If it was, hit the like button, subscribe for more awesome tech content, come follow me on Twitch if you like, and say hi and chat. Until next time, I'm Vox. Happy streaming. Thanks for watching this episode of my OBS Studio tutorial course. More videos like this and a full master class are linked in the playlist in the video description.